Welcome to Stock Invest YouTube channel and this stock report for Castor Maritime. The report was first published on our website April 14, 2022, but this is a more detailed version which also includes some fundamental data you need to know. In this 7 to 10 minute long video we give you the information you need to know about Castor Maritime for the upcoming trading day on Monday 18th, like support and resistance levels, signals, chart analysis, price to earnings ratios, and possible trading levels. Make sure you watch the entire report so you don't miss out on some key information needed for your trading. Please remember to subscribe so we can continue to grow and give you these free videos. Make sure to hit like and notification bell so you will be first to know when we post a new video. Now just sit back, relax, listen and watch the screen as we will show you some interesting data as we move along with the report. In this section you will get some information about the current Castor Maritime performance to better understand the where the stock is right now. In our systems, the Castor Maritime stock currently holds a 6.180 score, and our system has ranked Castor Maritime by candidate since April 11, 2022. If you were following our analysis you would have had an amazing gain of 18.69% since we first told you to buy Castor Maritime 4 days ago. This is an average return of 4.67% per day since first recommended. In our daily updates for Castor Maritime our last headline reads, Castor Maritime Incorporated stock price up 4.91% on Thursday. The Castor Maritime Incorporated stock price gained 4.91% on the last trading day, Thursday, April 14, 2022, rising from $2.24 to $2.35. And has now gained 5 days in a row. It will be exciting to see whether it manages to continue gaining or take a minor break for the next few days. During the day the stock fluctuated 9.26% from a day low at $2.16 to a day high of $2.36. The price has been going up and down for this period, and there has been a 27.72% gain for the last two weeks. Volume fell on the last day by minus 4 million shares and in total, 5 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $10.68 million. You should take into consideration that falling volume on higher prices causes divergence and may be an early warning about possible changes over the next couple of days. In the last 52 weeks, the highest price of the stock was $5.87, and the lowest price was $1. Right now the price is 59.99%, or $3.52, below 52-week high in 94.25%, or $38.55 below all-time high November 1, 2019 where the price hit $40.90. The Castor Maritime Stock Trends, Predictions and Analyst Ratings Soon we will give you the analyst ratings for the stock, but first the trends. The stock lies in the upper part of a very wide and strong rising trend in the short term, and this may normally pose a very good selling opportunity for the short-term trader as reaction back towards the lower part of the trend can be expected. A breakup at the top trend line at $2.44 will firstly indicate a stronger rate of rising. The current 3-month trend indicates a possible 46.23% change over the next 3 months, with a possible return between 52.33% and 94.69%. The 12-month trend it indicates a minus 47.42% change over the next 12 months with a possible return between minus 45.57% and 6.37%. This equals a price between $1.28 and $2.50 after a year. Analyst Ratings and Price Targets From analysts Castor Maritime Stock received a general buy rating. The analysts give P.E. ratio a neutral and price to book a neutral rating. For the return on investment the analysts give the Castor Maritime Stock a neutral rating. In this section we will give you some information about signals found for Castor Maritime. We will start with the general picture before we move on some of the most famous indicators and signals that will give you a deeper and better understanding of the trading possibilities in the stock. Mostly positive signals in the chart today. The Castor Maritime Incorporated stock holds by signals from both short and long-term moving averages giving a positive forecast for the stock. Also, there is a general buy signal from the relation between the two signals where the short-term average is above the long-term average. On corrections down, there will be some support from the lines at $1.95 and $1.78. A breakdown below any of these levels will issue sell signals. 
A buy signal was issued from a pivot bottom point on Tuesday, March 15, 2022, and so far it has risen 46.88%. Further rise is indicated until a new top pivot has been found. Furthermore, there is a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD. Volume fell during the last trading day despite gaining prices. This causes a divergence between volume and price and it may be an early warning. The stock should be watched closely. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence holds a buy signal. Pivots gave a buy signal 23 days ago. Bollinger gave a buy signal 4 days ago. The short-term moving average for the 3-month chart gave a buy signal 5 days ago. The long-term moving average for the 3-month chart gave a buy signal 5 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages in the 3-month chart gave a buy signal 47 days. If we look at the 12-month chart we see, short moving average gave a buy signal 5 days ago. The long-term moving average gave a buy signal 20 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages gave a buy signal 22 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk and Stop Loss for Castor Maritime On the downside, the stock finds support just below today's level from accumulated volume at $1.98 and $1.90. There is natural risk involved when a stock is testing a support level, since if this is broken, the stock then may fall to the next support level. In this case, Castor Maritime Incorporated finds support just below today's level at $1.98. If this is broken, then the next support from accumulated volume will be at $1.90 and $1.83. This stock may move much during the day, volatility and with a large prediction interval from the Bollinger Band this stock is considered to be high risk. During the last day, the stock moved 20 cents between high and low, or 9.26%. For the last week, the stock has had a daily average volatility of 11.91%. The stock has a beta of 0.26. This tells us that Castor Maritime is minus 0.74 times less volatile than the market. Let us have a look at some fundamental data you should be aware of before we tell you some possible good trading levels for Castor Maritime. The price to earnings ratio, PE ratio, is the ratio for valuing a company that measures its current share price relative to its per share earnings. Castor Maritime currently has a price earning ratio of 3.81. This is an relatively low price to earnings ratio and either signal a low expectation for the future of the company or that the stock is undervalued and could indicate a buying opportunity. Here are some possible good day trading levels. The stock does not have any resistance from accumulate volume above and may therefore move very fast upwards given the right conditions. You should therefore enter the stock and use volume to determine when to exit. On a downturn Castor Maritime finds first level of support at $1.98 and this is a natural place to put your bet if the support holds with an expectation of a rebounce upwards. Other levels you should watch based on the famous Fibonacci model are Buy at $2.21, $2.17, Sell at $2.37, $2.41, The average ratings combined from several analyst sources for Castor Maritime is buy. Our recommended stop loss is $2.28, minus 3.12%. This stock has high daily movements and this gives high risk. There is a buy signal from a pivot bottom found 22 days ago. Is Castor Maritime stock a buy? Castor Maritime Incorporated holds several positive signals and is within a strong rising trend. As the old saying says, let the trend be your friend. We therefore consider it to be a good choice at these current levels and we are expecting further gains during the next three months. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day our systems find that the current price is overvalued. For the trading on Monday 18th we expect Castor Maritime to open down negative $0.0600 and start trading at $2.29. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities.
You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. That's the end of this video, thanks for watching. Leave a comment if you have any questions and don't forget to subscribe to the channel.